We're going to go over the eight energies in Tai Chi. So we go here for push hands, you step forward, and you push on me. There's expansion. Okay, and you can see here, I'm not locking up as you push on me. You can see here, there's a whole wave I'm going with the body, so it is internal. So the first one's expansion, and I like how my teacher breaks the first four down. He breaks the first four down as you can pretty much do it on clock. So from 9 to 12 o'clock, I can do expansion. Okay, now you push on me, redirection. Okay, and that's like control of the three. So if as you push on me, I've got expansion there, I can roll over in redirection. All right? So second one's redirection. Okay. Third one, you know, if we go from 9 to 12 with expansion, if we go 12 to 3 with redirection, I can go from 3 to 6 with compression. And that's where your joints are coming. So, yeah, resist me a little bit. Oh, push out on me, I redirect, and then resist me a little bit, and there's your compression. All right? Okay, so expansion, redirection, compression. Okay, we're gonna finish going around the clock now with downward. So you push on me, expansion, as you push, I redirect, as you push, I come in, and then as you push, downward. Okay? And with Tai Chi, a lot of times, if as we work the clock, you push on me. As I'm coming with that down, a lot of times, you're being the move. Okay? So that's the first four. Our next four, all right, is going to be gunting, two opposite forces, right? So if we're doing Kali, and you throw a punch at me, that's gunting, two different directions. In Tai Chi, it might be more something like that, but I'm splitting forces, okay? So splitting forces is the next one, all right? And then here, as you push on me, if I come to this, plucking. And what you can see with plucking as you push on me is it's that roll, okay? It kind of, yeah, we'll break this down. But here, you can see, you can feel that roll and coming in with your body. Yeah, now, like we're talking about kind of a little bit like the ocean. You feel the undercurrent, you feel the wave pushing you away. And I can use that plucking force everywhere I touch it. All right? Right. Okay. So next one is I'm going to bring in the elbow. Okay? So if I've got a sphere right here, right, and we've been playing with this sphere here, here when I bring in the elbow, I'm working this sphere and I'm working this sphere. So now I've started playing with, as you push on me, all right, I'm still controlling here, and now I'm penetrating to the second sphere, okay? Last one, number eight, is I'm growing my shoulder and my whole body, but I think of that in a way of, if this is my first sphere, that's my second sphere, I'm gonna to touch the third sphere here. So here, when I bring in that shoulder, bring in that body, this is where I'll be touching the part of you that's behind you. Um, I'll hit here, and this is, you're gonna feel it over there. A good way to think about that this is an exercise. Um, it needs to be like your primary colors. You wanna mix them, you wanna blend them, you wanna use them in different times. Like, you, you push at me, I might use three or four all in one second. Right? So you don't you don't just go with expansion. Mm -hmm. Right? If you think of these like being you're wearing your primary colors, eight, to mix and match them in different ways, mm -hmm. um, think of like expansion like green. If I ask you to go off on a canvas and show me green, it's not a paint. Mm -hmm. I can see, hey, you know what green is. You know how to mix green, you know how to have a good brush brush stroke mm -hmm. with green, mm -hmm. right? But that's not painting. Pain is when you combine the different colors and put them all together and use them. And if you think about the eight, um, okay, yeah, we're going internal in terms of using our own body, but if I'm boxing, that's expansion. I'm expanding out, right? 
Um, if I come here and we're doing, say, grappling or Brazilian Jiu-Jitsu or something, we might do compression or downward, right? You're, you're going to have all these energies in everything, right? So Tai Chi is just idea of we're going to break them down. We're going to try to get a better understanding of them. And to be used effectively, you should do what a lot of folks do in arts where they fight and they stress test, put them together. Play with them. How do you mix them? How do you paint mm -hmm. with them? Mm -hmm. right?